Hi team, good morning. I would like to explain about one of the critical topic in supporting project as a consultant, what to be considered for preventing the transaction. So if you think from the user perspective, I am the end user in AP and AR. I want to know at month end, what must be done before I can close the periods? Are there any issues which will prevent me from closing the periods? Which unprocessed transaction can prevent the periods from being closed? This I want to know. Then Oracle provided in EBS and Fusion, very, very important reports. Payables period close exception report. This report main objective to show the preventing transactions in AP application. And uh, it shows majorly, okay, within the ledger business unit specific. And you can see the unaccounted transactions like uh, unaccounted invoices, unaccounted payments, incomplete payment process request like payment batches unsubmitted supply portal in okay supply portal in devices other exceptions so user will go to navigator go to tools schedule process click schedule new process search the name Select the payable period close exception report. You can see it lists exceptions preventing close the accounts payable accounting period. So choose the your target book name. Here I will take the 08 Anna. Okay. So whatever BUs are there under this ledger, either single or multiple, it will consider all. It shows the exception options. You can submit it. Right. You can see the output and review and fix the issues. Second report. Subledger period close exception report. This report main objective it list out subledger journal entries, accounting events that fail accounting period close validation time. You can use subledger close exception report to view accounting events for uh, AP invoices, AP payments, AR invoices, AR receipts that will showing the fail in the period close exception report. This report is submitted by majorly ledger wise. This report will be submitted by ledger wise. This report will use for all subledgers, not only AP or AR. This report will available for all subledger. Subledger, please close exception shows XLA data, SL accounting data fail. This report will run automatically when you are trying to close the period, which will show the output. What are the preventing transaction with accounting? This report mainly refer the Oracle Business Intelligence Publisher output you can see. Let me show how to submit. If you see the payable period close exception, go here. We can see the 
Okay, in this business unit, we have unaccounted payment, unaccounted invoices. If you go to detail, you can see vendor name, invoice number, date, currency, which is unaccounted invoices, unaccounted payment. So user will review these all exceptions. User will review these exceptions. He will go to front-end application. He will query the invoice and he will take the course of the action to be closed this period. Then let me show the subledger exception report. Run the subledger close exception. It shows general, subledger general entries accounting events which is failed in the running month. So here different parameters are there. Here you need to identify which subledger you want to run. If you run the payable, it shows payable. If you run the receivable, it, it shows the receivable. So this report uh, main object to to show all subledger application exceptions, AP, AR, FA. Then let me show the ledger selection. General category, event class. Let me take November, can see the succeeded you can see the ledger id here even you can export to pdf excel sheet so here you can see the invalid exceptions accounting unprocessed accounting events it shows the payables. Here you can verify what are the invoices are unprocessed, payments unprocessed. Based on this two report, client like to go for okay, period closing the transactions, or you can take the decision to sweep to the next month for AP application and AR application. So Nowadays, we are getting the questions, very, very important question. Tell me what is the difference between period close exceptions, subledger close exceptions. Tell me what are the, okay, events will show the subledger period close exception report. What are the, okay, events are showing in the period close exception. As a functional consultant, we need to understand and explain in interviews. As a support consultant, we need to understand difference between both. We need to act accordingly at a period closure time. Thank you guys for watching the video.